Hello there, lovely people. It's Alex from Nintendo Life here, and I don't think I'm alone in saying that I haven't properly played Animal Crossing in quite a long time. I played it for a bit when the spring update came out, but I've got to be brutally honest, except for like at the weekend where I played it briefly for like an hour or so, I haven't played Animal Crossing in a, about a month. I think Part of that was, well, I'll put an explanation up now. But Lordy Lou, oh, what a surprise. Nintendo have only gone and blooming put out an update for it, haven't they? Yes, there is a new summer update. This is wave one of the summer updates. And supposedly, it's going to give us some new reasons to come back to Animal Crossing. So I'm going to see whether those reasons are valid. But anyway, that's more than enough waffling. Let's dive right into things. All right, so uh, there are a number of things. I'm going to hopefully look at all of them. I don't know whether they're all going to happen today. I may have to do some time traveling. I can't believe I just said those words. But I haven't got any stonks going at the moment, so it should be absolutely fine. You know, if you don't tell anyone, I won't. For some time now, Nyukink has been exploring the water surrounding our island. I am pleased to announce that, based on their findings, the ocean's... <laughs> Being deemed safe for swimming, it took that long, did it? What's more, the water itself is clear and clean, which are the perfect conditions for underwater diving. Uh, please the proper swimwear, yeah, obviously. Purchase a wetsuit from either the shop or Nook Shopping. I can't wait to see the folks out there diving, playing, splashing the appropriate amount, of course, absolutely. Cool. That That's all, that's all she's going to mention. She's not going to mention the other stuff that they've put in, because... Why? I'm gonna have quite a few letters, aren't I? I've got quite a few letters, haven't I? Those can wait. It's time to go diving for stuff. So I'm assuming it's gonna be like in the cabinet or something. This is the first time I've I've played this. Um, it's specifically. Oh, there's a, there is a surfboard now. I looked for a surfboard when I played at the weekend, and there wasn't a surfboard. You're rinsing me. What's in the cabinet? It's got to be in here, hasn't it? Because it's not out. Yeah, there's one. Look at that. I'm going to look so hot in that. Yes, horizontal striped wetsuit. Before you head to the beach, perhaps we can give you a few pointers about swimming. Okay. <laughs> Come on. You want to put on the suitable wetsuit? Yes. Once you're suited up, press A from the beach nearby rocks to hop into the water. Swim around, keep pressing A, and if you see a shadow, you can press Y to dive and check it out. Amazing. It's almost like the same controls as the rest of the game. So I'm assuming it's going to be like, um, it's not going to be an item of clothing per se. Why have I got some fossils in here? Oh. Oh, they're fossils I don't need. So let's shimmy slide on over down to the beach. Hey, there's Gulliver. It's, it's standard Gulliver. Of course it is. You can't change clothes whilst you're transformed. God's sake. Let's get the bamboo wand out because it's the only one I've got. I've, I've forgotten the controls. And revert outfit. What was I wearing before? Brilliant. Da, 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 da. That's a great, that's a very bold look. And into the water. Yeah, that's pretty much the same as it was before, wasn't it? And you just swim and you swim, swim around. I've got to be honest, I didn't think they were going to add this because... You know, it's kind of, oh, how far can I go? Ah, they've added a net. Of course they have. <gasps> There's a thingy. I didn't think they'd add this, really, because it seemed like too significant a uh, thing to add down the line, but it shows what I know. The chef's hat's wet now. This is an acorn barnacle. Will it grow into an oak barnacle? Glad to see that the, um, the ludicrous things they say <laughs> are still present. I would be thoroughly disappointed if they weren't. I've got a feeling, can't you dive under the water and like swim around for a little bit? Could you do that before? It's been so long since I played New Leaf, let alone played New Leaf and actually done that. Okay, yeah, so I can hold my breath for a bit. Oh yeah, because some of the move. I have got a finny boy yet! It's so typical that I would get a fin fish appear for the first time, when that's not what I came to do. Fish, damn it! Yeah, I'm pleased with that. Let's go, can we go back into the water with the fishing rod out? It doesn't look like it. Can we? No, no, just, just, just wants to cast. I wonder whether there's gonna be anything rare out because it's... Get it, get it! Yes, you could go underwater because things could run away from you, couldn't they? Hey, it's a shell! A whelk! <laughs> A whelk. Oh, oh, there's a thingy, there's a thingy. Come here, you bad boy. Yeah. 
all this, none of this stuff is trying to move, so I'm guessing... Oh, that's a muscle, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I know some things, because it's like one of the only things of note we have in the sea surrounding the United Kingdom. I'm going to have so much to donate. Come back here. Was that thing moving? It's another muscle, so probably not. I've never seen a muscle move. Ooh! A sea pineapple! I'm betting you maybe shouldn't try and eat it like a pineapple. Oh, and of course there's new Nook Miles stuff as well. I can't get my phone out. The oh no, I can. I just can't be moving. That's good. You just don't, don't use your phone in the sea, kids. Really, don't use your phone in the sea. Deep dive. I really like that they keep adding... Like, it's not just they throw the fact that there's things like the underwater stuff. Hey, I got a reaction thing as well. They actually go in proper with it, you know, they they add the Nook Miles stuff. It properly becomes an integrated part of the game, whereby you wouldn't even know it wasn't part of the original game if you pick this up down the line. Like, you didn't get this at launch, but say you bought that this this week or something, you'd just be like, well, yeah, of course you can dive for stuff. Because it's all integrated. It's seamless. It's wonderful. Is that another muscle? No! It's something you shouldn't touch with your hands. I got a sea urchin. I wasn't even urchin for it. I need to I need to find I need to find me an oyster. But first I'm gonna I'm gonna jump off some of the rocks. I've just realized this is gonna shatter the illusion of one of my things. Hang on! This whole thing means that now you can essentially section off areas of your island entirely that are only going to be accessible via the water. So the scum that live on your island aren't going to be able to get there. This is a game changer. This is pod racing. I like that little animation. That's good. That's good. They could have so easily made it so that you could only get into it from a beach. But no, you can do a little little dive bomb. That that makes me happy. Come on, you little... So Ooh. Slightly faster moving, maybe? No, it's another whelk. They don't move fast. Oh, that's... Oh, no, that... No, for a second it looked like you can actually zoom the camera out like that. Well, pivot it. Oh! 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 Movie, movie. Come here. It's a scallop! Yeah! This is what I wanted. Look at that, it's your boy Pascal. He's an otter. <laughs> This is another new part of the update. I am pleased this happened. Can he have the scallop? Well, I, I'm guessing I need it for the museum, but at the same time, mate, he looks upset. He looks upset, doesn't he? I've got to give him the scallop. Let's give him the scallop. Thanks for your generosity, man. He's such a chilled dude, isn't he? <laughs> Since you were cool about the scallop. If you want to pronounce it scallop, or if you want to leave a comment telling me that I'm pronouncing it incorrectly, feel free. I left you a cool recipe in return. The pearls you need for that recipe are rare, but you can sometimes find them on the ocean floor. Oh, pearls! That wasn't a thing before, was it, in New Leaf? I keep my eyes open for them too, and might even trade you, uh, trade you for a scallop if I find one. Might even trade you for a scallop if I find one. What, so he'll give me a pearl if I give him a scallop? Yeah, that's a, that's a very American way of saying things. I never like that. Like, oh, I'll write you. Uh, what does that mean? You can't write a person. Forget give and take. This is give and give. That's how we win. You dig? Now, if you don't mind, I'd like to lay some truth on you. The deep kind. Feel this. Wait for this, guys. Never count your chickens before they've hatched. You've got to respect their privacy, man. <laughs> oh, he's mad. Wrap your noodle around that one. Yep, today is a good day. Oh, I love Pascal. Look at him go! He's off uh, the little sea otter that he is. Do you know which otter I miss? You know which otter I miss. I miss Lyle. Oh, he actually reappears out the back there. Where's he gonna go? Can I follow him? Is he just gonna swim around happy because I gave him a scallop? That would be tremendous. He's looking at me! I want to speak to him. I can't speak to him. I'll try and catch this thing and then we'll see whether he's still around. Oh, come back here. Is it another scallop? It's not. Not even close. Well, kind of close. Pascal, please still be there. He's still there. <laughs> oh, that does genuinely make me happy. Another thing to catch. Come here. What do we got this time? It's another muscle. Is he just going to continue to swim? I mean, it's not like I've got things to do. I mean, I've got this video to make, but... I can do that at the same time. You guys seem to be happy. Whoa, it's the same thing again. Is he just gonna do laps? 
Is he doing laps? I want I want to speak to him. He's going too far away. Pascal, come. Oh no! No, he's going off screen. Oh! Oh, bad simultaneously, you cheeky little devil. But at the same time, that's kind of a cool way to get him to go away properly rather than just disappearing or even just diving under the water. More bubbles! Come here, come here, come here, come here. You're not that fast, what are you? Another scallop! It ought to be savoured. Oh. He doesn't come again. Mermaid rug. Oh yeah, it's like mermaid stuff, isn't it? Which I'm not mad keen on. Just because... Not really my thing, it's like mermaids, unicorns, all that sort of thing. Nah, I can take it or leave it. But at the same time, it's new DIY recipes, and there's going to be quite a few people out there that really like that sort of thing. So from that point of view, I am down for that. Oh, come back here. Come back here. Hey, at least I've got a scallop for the museum, eh? What's this? Another sea urchin. I can't look at those now without thinking about... I've forgotten his name. Ooh, something new. It's a jellyfish. A moon jellyfish. Ooh, the peanut butter fish. I've never had that and I don't get it. Like, sweet and peanut butter doesn't go for me. Call me old-fashioned, but it's savoury or nothing, baby. Right, let's go and donate some goodies. Hello, blathery boy. Is he gonna, like, make a big thing because it's kind of like a new donation or is it just gonna be treated like fish? Oh, the news that I simply must discuss with you, Alex. Sea creatures and other marine wonders can now be found off the shores of our very own Stolny. Also, I've heard. Any hoot, tis exciting stuff, is it not? Uh, yes. Um, Blathers is going on a bit. That's kind of his thing. I found a sea creature! Which, um, I'm just gonna do... Uh, can I do multiple at a time, or is it just gonna be one? I'm gonna give him the jelly... F it is just one at first, that's fine. It's gonna be interesting to see how he reacts. A moon jellyfish. Fine, I'm guessing. Oh, he, li he likes them a lot. Would you entrust this marvellous marine find to me? All yours! Uh, as he... Yes! I was really worried there weren't going to be any fascinating facts. I would love nothing more. The moon jellyfish. What's not to love about this pretty floating flower of the sea? That's Blather's real voice, by the way. Well, I suppose its tentacles do give a sting when touched, but it's only a mild thing to the likes of us. Ha ha ha! By which he means birds, obviously. Other creatures may not be fo so fond of this translucent beauty, though who can blame them, really? Moon jellyfish have stinging cells called... Oh, God. Stingy boys that kill fish and other small creatures that float by. And they use their oral arms to pull these morsels into their mouths and stomachs. He's got a lot to say about this. Indeed, uh, what the... <laughs> but observe the moon jellyfish to see how brutal and beautiful nature can be. That was actually quite a long thing. Hell yeah. But moreover, it should be said that we're most fortunate to have an island such as this. Indeed, as of now, we've begun accepting don- I've just- I've just- I've just- Ooh, there we got the acorn barnacles there, and a seahorse, apparently. Acorn barnacle, hey! Hey, there's the whelk! <laughs> Show me the whelk. Oh, and the scallop. Scallop, sea urchin, and a whelk. This is a good tank now. I've got to say, the previous update was pretty good with like red and everything in the art gallery, but this does feel more significant because red was just, it's just buying art essentially, which is fine and it's good and I like the art system, but red never bloody turns up for one thing. And the other thing is that this actually opens up where you can go, which is brilliant. I really like that. Look at my weeds. So this guy right here has the nerve to show up in his normal clothes, which is just rude, frankly. I'm guessing uh, there's nothing. Yeah, what's with the rude awakening? Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> is he going to have a thing new to say or is this? He must have fallen overboard and wash up on the beach. Usual thing. He's going to use his uh, handy dandy little thing and it's not going to work because it never does. What he needs is some random parts that are buried in the ground, which makes more sense. No way. Okay, so it's time to perform absolute sacrilege and do some time traveling and see whether I can get it, uh, the other thing to happen. He's not here. 
Excellent. He's not here either. God damn you, Gulliver. Well, uh, um, here he is. Yes, he appeared so suddenly he interrupted my pizza break. Hmm. So yes, this is the third and final part of this uh, current update. It's a different... It's, it's just Gulliver again. Yeah, it's not actually a different character. He does seem to be uh, talking differently as well. Talking about more sort of in a pirate manner, which makes sense. And there's only one way to wake him up, as I'm sure you know. Why have I got a flimsy net? Oh well, it works. Come on. Oh, I just spoke to him. That's not gonna work. Come on. Whack. Oh, oh, he's up, he's up, he's up. He went, Ah, ah! this buffet be the end of me, lads. But I think I can tamp a bit more peach cobbler down again. Oh, peach cobbler's nice. Uh, buffet, trickery, bah! Captain Gallivar! God's sake. Feared for all manner of dreadful gullduggery. <laughs> so he's, he's chatting away, <laughs> and I'm guessing... I don't know what he's actually going to do. Um, parking a bit of the gold, soda with the crew, tumbled to prowl into the sea. Uh, living on the edge of gadgety... Oh, so he's still going to have his thing. Yeah. Oh, no! He doesn't even have his communicator. Oh! I get it. I get it. He doesn't even have his communicator full stop. New animation and everything. Down for that, so I'm guessing... It's gonna be in the water, isn't it? <laughs> okay, that's better than I feared it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be the same thing over and over again. So I'm gonna have to go back into the water. I'm gonna find some rocks. Oh no, there's. I can do it from this, can't I? Hoa bow! That's good. There's another fin boy. Oh, you're much further away than I thought. It's another whale shark. Let's find his blooming communicator. I was going to angle this down as well, get a better idea of where everything is. I'm guessing the communicator is going to have the magical ability to run away. Is this going to be it? Yes! <laughs> oh, I found it straight away. Bring it back to that pirate. You know exactly who it is, virtual me. So then we just give it back to him and... Uh, yar, I have. It's as simple as that. <laughs> and is it going to work or am I going to have to find parts as well? Uh, the extra cherries on top can contact my faithful crew. Oh no, it is working. It's still, the screen's still broken, which, nice touch. Okay, so unsurprisingly, it looks like it functions in exactly the same way as normal Gulliver. Uh, nothing left to do but, oh, Simon's online. Nothing left to do but wander this here beach and look mean. Here I go. Arr. I'm sorry if we talk to him now. Uh, that message of mine has surely reached me buccaneer buddies by now. Let's check the SMS bounty. No replies yet. Poor sod. <laughs> Do you think he ever gets picked up or if he just dies and there's an endless stream of Gullivers? And there we have it. That is the new update for Animal Crossing Summer Wave 1. And I've got to say, I think it's overall, it's a substantial update. Going into the sea is a big deal and I really like it. Will this actually bring me back to Animal Crossing? I reckon it will. I don't think it's going to hold my attention for you know, months and months on a time, but I, I reckon I'm probably going to be picking this up every couple of days or so now, even if it's only for an hour or so. Yeah, there's there's more to do. I'm down for this. I am down for this. Is this going to bring you back to Animal Crossing? Let us know with a comment down below. You know it's right. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, then why don't you click that subscribe button? And be sure to check out NintendoLife.com for all sorts of lovely Nintendo-related content. Thank you again for watching. Bye-bye.